age is supposed to insulate the elderly from gratuitous violence, particularly in close-knit communities like Blasha Miku. But two elderly sisters from that community learned the hard lesson that this unwritten code can just as easily be broken. According to the account of 69-year-old Elizabeth Thomas, she and her 73-year-old sister were on the receiving end of a vicious attack by two young men of the Blusher community. The younger alleged batterer, only 16 years of age. She recounts her harrowing experience in Creole. Ouais, her effort to find out why her older sister was physically attacked resulted in her being hit in the face and head with a bottle. And according to her, when she fell to the ground, the blows intensified, only this time with a stick. <laughs> Following the beatings, Elizabeth Thomas and her sister were taken to the St. Jude Hospital, where they were treated and given an appointment for a follow-up visit. The sisters reported the matter to the Miku police station, but were unimpressed with the service. Moi dou bout la over avec pièce police pour covid. Yo j'ai sans les phone. Yo j'ai sans les phone. Moi vie moi tourner moi tourner de moi moi dou bout bola pour la croix pour les yo couiller moi. Pourtant moi et yo pour cop garder moi juste toujours. Efforts to contact the alleged perpetrators were unsuccessful. News force spoke with the officer at the front desk of the Miku police station who confirmed that a report was indeed made by Elizabeth Thomas on Saturday 19th August and said that the matter is being investigated. Stanley Lucien for the HS News Force.